Today I show you three heads we strung up for our good buddy Spencer. What's going on, Thorner? Today I have three heads for our good buddy Spencer. Um, quick backstory on Spencer, he was just a fan and then when we were up in Syracuse uh, playing against the Stingers, I got in contact with him and asked him if he wanted to walk around with a GoPro. He had some photography um, in his past so he jumped on the chance and from that we've been pretty good friends. We do a lot of stuff together via social media, um, cool stuff going back and forth and all around just a great guy and um, a good person in the lacrosse community. And he sent us um, some heads to string and this time he sent us three and just kind of said do what you want. He had some ideas with them and uh, we just kind of went off on them and they looked unbelievable. So first up, we have a gate torque with a boxer pocket with 15 mil white throw mesh. You cannot really get any better than this if you're looking to play some serious box. Up top, we got yellow, we got gray on the sides, yellow in the throat, all white shooters and metal locks, which just set it off to be absolutely Gorgeous, it's got that nice mid-high to it, the boxer does, and a beautiful channel fits the torque, absolutely perfect. He's got a pretty cool um, die on here, which I really like, it's asymmetrical actually. We've got some yellow over here, and then black comes all the way up and then halfway on this side. Really, really cool look to it. Um, it's got uh, Midnight on the back, uh, McQuaid on the front, so some interesting die points. They're probably my favorite, and they got a little knight in here. Uh, probably my favorite, it says AMDG, which is an acronym for the Latin, um, uh, for the greater glory of God. Um, so it's pretty cool, which is normally a Jesuit saying, so I wonder um, if this is for a Jesuit school. But uh, that's the first one, which is a gate tour. This next head I thought was gonna be the crown jewel of these three until I saw the last one. Um, it is a Warrior Evil Pro X6 brand new um, with a boxer pocket. I used this stick for almost a year, this exact setup. Absolutely love this combination. Again, it's got 15 mil white thrown. Up top, we have um, a crown top in yellow and black sides are yellow, black in the throat, all white shooters and uh, metal locks. So very, very similar colorway to the uh, Torque, just a little bit different die. So um, on this one, what we did is we got uh, his number two on, um, or his number two, so we put it on that side. And we also did a thrown tee on that side. We got a black to yellow to white fade. Uh, Chris hooked him up with this die. Really, really clean. I love the black scoop with the white shooters. Um, just gives it a great look to it. And in terms of the pocket, I mean, you guys have seen this. I've showed you my stick, nice mid high and a gorgeous channel. Uh, yeah, when I finished this thing, I was like, whew, that thing is mint and definitely gonna be the, uh, the crown jewel and just be awesome until we string up this next one. So this is the final stick for Spencer. He said he had it laying around, just sent it to us and said, do whatever you want. And it is a Warrior Evo 4 Mini and we hooked it up with a Throne Leather Pita. Absolutely ridiculous, but when you're a friend of ours and you say go off, we normally do something pretty crazy. So it's got the unreleased gray Throne Leather in, which is just amazing. Yellow center, white mids, black outers, yellow sidewalls. We got a black nylon and yellow shooters. Looks unbelievable. Um, I had to shallow it up a little bit. It was a little bit too deep um, when throwing with an actual ball and uh, it just kind of was just too much whip on it. So we shallowed up, kind of made it more for like a mini ball, a little rubber ball. Um, it looks unbelievable. Probably the hardest thing to string up was the throat because it tapers pretty aggressively and having real leather in there um, they were starting to bunch a little bit so really balancing all out making a nice mid pocket was probably the hardest part but it's a uh, mini with like a legit throne pita in it which is just unbelievable um, I think uh, he's just gonna be chilling with it I mean I know he just moved so I thought it'd be cool to do something that's just a little showpiece that he could have for his house and I thought this would be absolutely perfect considering he just sent it to us and was like whatever you want to do um, so it turned out unbelievable now you can tell why I said when that Evo was done I was so excited and then when it, Mac, uh, Mac and I finished this up I was like oh my god it's unbelievable so here's the three heads for Spencer we got the mini Evo the Evo X6 and the torque let me know what your guys favorite is in the comments below and Spencer I hope you love them buddy um, we did do some really really cool stuff stuff for you um, because you're an awesome dude. So that's everything guys. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll talk to you guys soon. How thick and tall it is, um, which I don't think I'd really want that far out on the stick, but um, we'll see if they keep developing